Welcome to InThisCornerTV.com, sponsored by Takate. I'm Smitty at the MGM Grand. You know, it takes two to tango. It takes two to, to make a great dance. It takes two to make a great fight. And unfortunately, only one guy was here to fight tonight, and that was Manny Pacquiao, who scored a lopsided decision over Sugar Shane Mosley. He scored a knockdown in round number three. I had uh, Manny winning the fight 119 to 107. After the fight, we caught up briefly with Manny Pacquiao and his legendary trainer, Freddie Roach. Manny, do you think you could have gotten a stoppage had Shane decided to fight uh, instead of just survive? You think he would have stopped him? I think he's um he's uh w the first knockdown on the on the third round he um he's trying he's, I think he's scared and he didn't want to fight toe to toe with me and he's trying to to finish the run. Freddie, it takes two to tango. It seemed like only one guy was in there to fight tonight, and that was your guy Manny Pacquiao. Definitely one guy trying to win the fight and one guy trying to survive and a little uh, disappointing, but uh, that's. That's the way it goes. Is it hard to gauge your fighter's performance because uh, the other guy wasn't cooperating and he was in a defensive posture like the prevent defense the whole time? Pretty much. You know, Manny did what he was supposed to do. He won every round. He won every minute of every round. And so I, I couldn't really ask him no more. You know, we did have a problem with the cramps in his legs, and he really couldn't really get the, uh, the firepower that he really wanted. The fourth round until uh, ninth round, ten rounds, uh, I really hurt. It's like... I feel like one legs. What do you think caused that, the cramps? Oh, the cramps, he, they, they come once in, once in a while. You know, his calves are so big. He, he, we've had problems with that in the past, but, you know, we have exercise and potassium to take care of that usually. But uh, for some reason, uh, they, they cramped up a little bit tonight. But um, no excuses, though. But uh, he did uh, he did pick it up in, in the, the, the 10, 11, 12 and really tried to finish the show. And, uh, you know, I just, um, I, I like Shane Mosley, he's a good guy and stuff like this, but uh, I hope he retires before he gets hurt. I agree with you. Now, please tell the world what the hell do you want next. For, I already know, so just tell them. Well, you know, the only fight out there right now, may, it makes sense because we can't get Mayweather out there to, to the table. I guess uh, Marquez because they have uh, history. They have two good fights together, very close fights. Uh, depending on what style you like, you could pick one guy or pick the other. And... Uh, I just would like to gauge uh, that fight and see how much Manny has really improved uh, since, you know, over the years because I think he's a much better fighter, fighter now than he was uh, when they fought. But uh, we, we, I, I think that's a very sellable fight and uh, a fight that would uh, have a huge audience. For me, I can fight anybody. You know, it's very stressful to us if we start calling with the, the boxer. He don't want to fight. If he don't want to fight, you know, it's. Uh, we want to fight, but uh, somebody will do, will do want to fight, so what are we going to do? You know? Well, do me a favor, though, because Floyd watches all my stuff. Just get send a message to Floyd Mayweather. Tell him something for me, please. You know, the, what, what can I say? Um, my guy likes to fight. He, he hasn't fought in over a year. He, he, he must, he, he's out of even the ratings right now because he, you don't fight in a year. You, you must not love the sport anymore. So I, I don't even know if he, if he even wants to fight anymore. He's, he's, you know, he talks to talk, but he, walk to walk, Floyd. All right, thanks, Freddie. So what's next for this uh, fire plug from the uh, Philippines who's on an express train, the, the likes of which we haven't seen since Roy Jones Jr. was dominating everybody in boxing? Right now, to be honest with you, Floyd Mayweather, the fight everybody has been wanting, is irrelevant. Uh, Floyd is, uh, wants to be a celebrity now and obviously not a fighter. Juan Manuel Marquez, that name, of course, uh, you heard Freddie mention. That's a possibility. I actually think Manny's just too doggone big for him at this point. Names like Timothy Bradley and Zab Judah are in the picture. I don't think you'd see Manny step up and try to take on a Sergio Martinez. I just think that's uh, too much of a climb. So what Manny does next, well, it remains to be seen. But for now, he is clearly the best fighter in boxing. From the MGM Grand, I'm Smitty.